hi everybody welcome back to our channel family food and fun i hope everybody is having a wonderful day or had a wonderful day because it is the end of the day so while we were out and about exploring you know trying different stores where we are we found this place that does seafood mm -hmm. um K&S Seafood. Yeah, it's called K&S Seafood. It's kind of like one of those small hole-in-the-wall kind of type places. When you first see it, you'll probably, mm, you know, turn your nose up at it. But usually those are the best places to try. So we have some, some crab legs. Snow crab legs. If y'all can see those. So I had a taste for crab legs, but I had the expectation you know how you get your own crab legs and then you steam them at home and then you use like the I think it's the New Orleans Louisiana seafood boil yeah the Bay Town Bay seasoning yeah with your Cajun seasoning so they actually steam them there for you and she put some in butter and garlic I've never had butter and garlic crab legs never so this is my first time trying the butter and garlic crab legs so I was like well why not try it you know, with you guys and let y'all know what I think. Hmm. And I don't really particularly care for crab legs. So, if I'm impressed, then they're really good. So, I told my wife that I would sit in and try it with her, even though I don't like crabs. So, we got this one. And then we got another claw. And it was $22 a pound. Mm -hmm. So, yeah. So, we're gonna, I'm gonna try this out. Mm. That is it good? Yeah, that seasoning is good. I'm used to like having the, the Cajun seasoning. Oh, I'm not trying to get my white shirt dirty. Mm. That's good. Well, let me tell you, I, I need some meat for me to really. Mm. You like it? That is good. It's really, I'm not lying, it, it really is good. It's actually different for us because. Mm. Well, you know, like. For me, I don't eat seafood. The only seafood I eat is tilapia and shrimp. But I didn't even eat fish, period. I only ate shrimp. But, um... But you know what tilapia... Everybody got something to say about tilapia. Tilapia is supposed to not be good. But it's good, it's good to me. Trust me. For you because it's um, farm-raised or something like that. But my wife has this way of cooking stuff sometimes. And if even if it's something I don't eat, like the way she seasons it and how good it is, like I'll start eating it. Now I love tilapia. Like I could literally eat it every weekend, every other day. Fried, that is. Ain't no meat down off up in there, y'all. Darn. It's actually good, but I'm a real frugal person. I want my money to go far. I want to get a lot for my money, but I understand when it comes to seafood, you know, sometimes you can't do that. Has anybody ever tasted Cunch? Yes, what is Cunch? C-O-U-N-C-H, right? It's, um... They have it over in the Bahamas. A lot of places sold it. This particular place that we went to today, they sold it. But we've never tried it. We saw a guy who was um, selling conch shells. So I guess it's a fish that lives inside those big spiral shells. But if you have, let us know. Let us know how it tastes. Maybe we'll try that. Yeah, because when we were in, um, excuse me, when we was in Nassau, and they started cooking the conch. It smells like fish, but it was like smelling like some good fried fish. Mm-hmm. Baby, you got to um, 
crack me a piece of that thing on open, girl. I'm gonna crack you one. Yeah. Y'all, this is really good. That seasoning. Let me tell you something. Seasoning can make the worst thing taste really like good. the best thing. Right. To steam these things in butter and garlic. Wow. Now I don't want that piece, baby. I do. I want the piece inside here. Yeah. Okay. And no, y'all, this is not one of those, what you call it, mukbang? Sloppy eating videos, I call them. It's not a mukbang, y'all. I just wanted to show you guys what we working with. See, they jipping us, they jipping us on this end right here, though, for real. Yeah, ain't no meat in that one. Because if you look here, it's hollow inside there. So something is up with that. That crab was weak. He didn't have no muscles up in there. There you go, baby. Mm. That was a whole lot of meat in that one. Mm, baby. This that was is good. good. Yeah, so I actually like... That's how red lobster and stuff need to start doing it. I don't like red lobster crab legs, y'all. Something ain't right about their crab legs. I don't know what it is, but I do not like red lobster crab legs. No, no, no. Something artificial. Something ain't right with red lobster. But this came from K and S Seafood. Mm -mm. Something on my mouth. Mm -mm. This came from K and S Seafood here in Florida. So if you are in the Florida area. KNS Seafood. It's a little hole in the wall. Don't turn your nose up at it. She's actually really good. It's clean in there. She has fresh fish in there, fresh shrimp. Um, they do have the crab legs, and I asked her, you know, do they sell the crab legs um, where you can cook them yourself? She said they used to at one point, but they don't do it like that anymore. I don't know why she didn't say why. But this is good, and I'll actually be going back to her. This mm -hmm. is real good, y'all. So, y'all yeah. see that good crab meat right there? Mm. And then we got the big claw. So, that's all we wanted. We just wanted to show you guys this. It's really good. I don't think y'all want to sit here and watch us eat this, like, right? No, but I'll tell you one thing. Whatever that seasoning is, then you need to figure out what that is so we can tell people about that and try okay so that's gonna be a video so i will figure out google it look it up play with a little recipe and then i'll come back and do my own crab legs mm -hmm. and um we'll do another video on that here you go baby yeah because i would literally i would literally eat crab legs if they tasted like that literally this is good y'all mm, babe It's good. Mm hmm Okay. I give it two thumbs up. Yep. Well, she get two thumbs up from us. KNS Seafood here in Florida. Check her out. And to be exact, Ocala, Florida. Okay? Or as I like to say, Ocala. <laughs> Ocala. Because I can't... I, I have a hard time pronouncing stuff. Remember when I went to Wendy's? Oh, God. And they had a... Um, their new they, chicken they sandwich. They had a new chicken sandwich. And I was like, oh, that sandwich looked good. I So I went up to the lady. I tried to text my wife. I tried to get through to my wife before I went up there because I know how I am with words. And she didn't answer. So I was like trying to ask her, how do you pronounce this word? And to me, it said Asia Go. The <laughs> word Asia and the word go put together. So I went up there and I asked the lady, uh, yeah, I want to try that. Because at that point in time, it was new. So you know when it's new, they don't have a number for the combo. If they did, I would just be like, well, give me a number five or whatever. But they didn't have it. So I said, walked up there, can I get that uh, Asia go sandwich? <laughs> and the lady said, Asia go? I said, yeah, the Asia go sandwich right up there, that chicken sandwich. She said, that does not say Asia go. That says Asiago. I said, oh, God. I said, just give me the sandwich then. 
I was mad as I don't know what. Then I, got, I finally got a hold of my wife and I told her how embarrassed I was. But yeah, yeah, he gets on the phone and he's like, babe, how do you say this word? So he spells it. I was like, Asiago. He was like, how do you know that that's Asiago? I was like, I watched the cooking channel a lot. <laughs> <laughs> so when he told me what happened, I felt bad for him, but it was hilarious. Hilarious. Mm. And I was going to eat inside, but after that happened, I was like, let me just get this to go. Because they're going to be back there talking about me. So I'm sorry, baby. I didn't get to my phone that day. Mm -hmm. My it's baby got good. embarrassed. <laughs> <laughs> but, but he yeah. know now. He know better now. <laughs> oh, yeah. But Ocala is where it's at. So. KNS Seafood. So make sure you give this video a thumbs up. Like, comment. Share, subscribe, tell somebody that knows somebody. And we're going to see y'all on the next one. And we're going to finish off these crab legs, y'all. They're so good. Yep. Mm, they're good. So see you on the next one, y'all. Peace.